80% of women notice the slowdown in their brain function. So 80% of women, the women who are having the most symptoms through perimenopause and menopause, have about a 30% decrement in their brain's ability to uptake glucose. And so the official name for it is cerebral hypometabolism. But what we know is that the entire system is related to the mitochondria in the brain not working the way that it once did. So mitochondria is starting to falter. The primary regulator is estrogen. You give them estrogen therapy be if they have a uterus together with progesterone. What we know is that it, it may make a difference. It may help with the brain function and the brain phenotype, and it may potentially reduce the risk of developing Alzheimer's disease, which we know is twice as common in women right. versus men. By giving estrogen replacement, you can lower the FSH as well. It's such a powerful tool that unfortunately way too few of us use as physicians and also as people, patients are not using this tool as part of their overall health and wellness journey. 